Hey there and welcome to this demonstration about Opti2Yo and Ventus. In this uh, specific demonstration, we show you how you can use Opti2Yo as a flaw tracker. In that case, you can see down here our OT1000 bundle. He is uh, yeah, roughly 5-10 cm scanning over our floor here, over our studio floor, which has a rough area of 3 meter by 3 meter. And uh, then we just simply get the touch points and uh, use them in Ventus with the touch paint node basically and as you can see this is pretty precise right if i move here my leg and uh, the touch points will very stable follow of course you also can use opti to your or this setup uh, for 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 person trackers in that case uh, you basically just would bring up the leader a little bit more right so that he basically scans yeah somewhere in the belly or in the in the in the height of the of the hips right and then you will get one touch point which is then basically your person so of course you can use that in many use cases you know for if you have a led floor and you want to play some games and want to activate uh, whatever some fields uh, you want to develop your own game with unity or with unreal engine or even with ventus of course um, of course, use it for, for virtual studios to get the, the position of the person of the host. You know, if he is in front of an object or if he is behind of a 3D object. So there are many, many use cases uh, where we probably also will try to give you more demonstrations in the near future. I think that's it for today. Uh, thank you for watching and see you soon again. Bye bye.